Saturday Social is powered by FIFA 22 with PlayStation. Hello Saturday Social, I'm Ben Foster. Welcome to my weekly vlog where we talk everything Premier League and in this episode we're actually going to talk a little bit of Champions League as well. We are about to get on the coach in about half an hour's time down to Norwich, a big game for us. So let's look at last weekend's results, in particular Manchester United and Cristiano Ronaldo. The guy just couldn't help himself, could he? Two goals to kickstart his second stint at Manchester United. Off to an absolute flyer. What a player. Romelu Lukaku, another two goals for that big dog. I've told you guys before, I've warned you, if you haven't got them in your fantasy Premier League team, get that wild card chip, activate it, Romelu Lukaku, Cristiano Ronaldo, they're guaranteed, they're musts. You have to have them in your team. They will not let you down, I promise you. Anyway, let's look at this weekend's fixtures. The one game that sticks out head and shoulders above everybody else has to be Tottenham against Chelsea. Sunday afternoon, Harry Kane against Romelu Lukaku. Chelsea have started the season on fire. They look a very, very strong outfit definitely going to be there or thereabouts at the end of the season tottenham again been a good start to the season but last weekend i don't think anyone saw this one coming did they three nil loss against crystal palace where on earth did that bad boy come from anyway champions league talk time and i want to talk about one player in particular erling harland the guy on wednesday has just scored his 21st champions league goal in only 17 games it's an absolute joke of a record let me put some context around this okay so after 17 games Cristiano Ronaldo how many goals had he scored zero absolutely zero after 17 Lionel Messi had only scored six will Erling Haaland go on to become the all-time Champions League top scorer He's got to, surely. He's absolutely got to. He is a generational talent. Now, he's currently, obviously, as you know, at Borussia Dortmund. But should he go somewhere else? Should I say a bigger team? Is that a fair way of putting it? OK, I'm going to play devil's advocate. Let's say he went to somewhere like Man City. He knows Man City. His dad used to play for Man City. If Erling Haaland went and signed for Manchester City, do we think he could go on and break... Cristiano Ronaldo's record of 135 Champions League goals. Leo Messi, 120 Champions League goals. But I think, should Erling Haaland get that move, that big move, I think he's doing it, guys. I do. I think he's that good. He's got absolutely everything in his locker. He's even got that crazy run. You know the run I'm talking about. It's world class. Anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoy this weekend's football. Stay safe. Have a lovely, lovely time and I will see you next Saturday, Saturday Social. You're a bunch of legends. See ya.